Hey everyone, I'm John Gonzalez. And I'm Amy Sherman, and we're about to reveal our pick for Fear, Fear of, of the, the month. month here at Hopcat. Hopcat opened in 2008 in downtown Grand Rapids and now has 17 locations all across the country, including eight right here in Michigan. And while every spot is unique, they all have one thing in common, to bring you great beer. Our pick for beer of the month for February is Greenbush Distorter Porter. This is a great beer, and Justin, I know it's one that you guys really like here at Hopcat. Yeah, we, we love Distorter. We love Porters. Uh, you like Distorter and you like Porter. <laughs> <laughs> we, like, we like them both. So, it's February. It's cold. This is a great beer to help kind of keep you warm through, through these tough winter months. I agree. These dark beers are the perfect selection, I think, for the, the winter months. Not only are they roasty, toasty, full of yummy malts and things like that, um, but they have a little bit more alcohol than maybe a, a regular beer. This one comes in right around 7%, right? Yeah, this one is 7.2%. I definitely wouldn't call it sessionable, but it's not it, It's not a full-blooded American stout, right? It's meant to be drank. It's meant to be enjoyed. So, uh, I got it in craft beer with new porters and stouts and browns. But what makes a porter a porter and a stout a stout? Because this is kind of confusing. This distorted porter is a little bit of both. Yeah. Uh, so last month we talked about the differences between IPAs and double IPAs. Uh, porters are kind of the bridge between brown ales and stouts. So uh, they're meant to be a common working man's beer. These ones have a lot of the same malt fill and hop fill as stouts, just with a little bit less ingredients. Helps keep the body a little bit lighter keep the alcohol percentage a little bit lighter. And one of the things that Greenbush says specifically about Distorter Porter is that it's a, a porterish stout or a stoutish porter. So it really does kind of blend those lines together on this one. It does, yeah. And if whichever your favorite style is, it works for both. In all eight locations throughout Michigan, this will be on tap everywhere, right? It's going to be on tap everywhere throughout the entire month of February. I like it. So everybody can try Distorter Porter. Why don't we try it right now? Oh, that's a good idea. All right. Yeah, that aroma is just so oh. roasty, toasty, um. so much chocolate malt, so much. It's not coffee. I don't want to say that because it isn't. It is a coffee, but it's it's kind of the essence of coffee. Is kind of what this you're getting. There's a little hint of sweetness, but not that much. Yeah, it's kind of velvety. It's a little bit yeah. more like a stout than a porter. All right, the perfect pairing with Green Bush's Distorter Porter. Justin, you would pick chili. <laughs> it's we kind of chili. a no-brainer. It's chili. Right? It's a no-brainer. So what makes it such a great pairing? Porter is a great beer to cook with. When it reduces down, it adds a lot of those roasty flavors and adds good body to uh, especially soups like chili. They play on each other well. They do, and even if you don't put it in the chili, having it on the side is actually, it's a, it's a nice complement to the chili. I feel it kind of cuts that richness of the meat or the beans, and with those toasty notes, it just kind of amplifies the whole thing. <laughs> yeah. Right, Gans? It sure does, and I know that Hopcat, you're known for your fries. So what would you do with the fries and the chili? Well, if it was me... Here we go. Watch this. Oh, yeah. Right all over those cosmic fries. Perfect. Woo! There's nothing better than a good chili cheese fry. <laughs> I have to say. I'm diving in right now. Yeah. I'm not even waiting. I'm not going to stop you. All right. You're good. Mm. Can't beat that. Nope. It's a total complimentary pairing. You've got that little bit of smokiness, a little bit of kind of almost nuttiness. And yeah. Adding in with that porter, that's nice. Well, thanks a lot, Justin. That was a lot of fun. <laughs> yeah, definitely. There it is, folks. Greenbush's Distorted Porter. Our pick for beer, beer of the month. month. And you can try it right here at Hopcat. For more information, go to MLive.com.